So, EA just dropped the base icon player pick. Let's open up some of these and hopefully get some decent base icons. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out MMO EXP. There is a link down below and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. It's an 86 rated squad with 188 and an 85 rated squad with 187. So it's really not that expensive at all. It's pretty decent value if you ask me. And it's one of three base icons. So, without further ado, here we go. Are we going to get a decent base icon? Eusebio, Cruyff, Pele, something like that. Here we go, EA, with our base icon player pick. Rio Ferdinand's not bad. I'm not going to lie to you. It's not amazing. I, I'm not I'm not jumping for joy. As a United fan, that's not terrible. It's, it's okay. That's all right. It, otherwise, it would have been terrible. It would have been really, really bad. But I believe base Rio is actually worth quite a little bit still. Is he not? About 200k. That's probably, what, break even for the pack. And he's not bad in game at all. Um, good pace split. Good defending. Good physical. I think he's lengthy. Although, I don't think that really matters these days anyway. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. I'll take that. For the first one, that's all right. And as a United fan, I'm happy about that. So, we'll take it. All right. We have my 85 double upgrade as well. Because I'm a day late for my um, daily SBC as well. So, we'll see what we get in this. We get ourselves Milan Skriniar. Do we get a dangler into wild card? Hey, we do actually. We got ourselves uh, Kevin Prince Boateng. So, cannot complain too much there. An 87 and 86. I'll take that. That's solid. All right. We have our next base icon player pick now. We're hoping to continue. I would say continue with the good ones. I don't think Ferdinand's insane. But, like, if we can get a few decent ones, that would be pretty good. You know, the Matthias's and the Hullets and stuff like that. Uh, Larm's not terrible. I still think Larm's got a bit of value. And he's probably one of the better left backs available that isn't really expensive so that's not too bad but it's not insane sadly is it all right next base icon player pick let's see what we get hopefully it's a little bit better the, the first two i'd say are pretty mid they're not terrible but not great oh two burkamps by the way and three of player picks i'm just saying i'm just keep a count just just keep track i'm just saying all right beckham makalele burkamp i think i picked beckham in this scenario makalele wouldn't be a terrible dm but i think i probably picked beckham here not great again, though, is it? All right, we have got my boy Steve-O's base icon player pick next. Can we get, like, a Muller or something? That'd be pretty cool. Oh, Vieira! Big W. Vieira's class. Vieira is very, very good. If he's not already got the World Cup Vieira, that is. Yeah, he hasn't. That's class. Vieira's our first, like, W. So I'm very happy about that. Vieira in this game, by the way, I absolutely hate him. Because of how good he is. Oh, Hullet, we'll see you later, mate. How did you get a red card on George Best, by the way? How did that happen? Vieira straight in the team. Big W. He is so good in this game. He's so good. I believe he also has the 81 times 11. So we're going to open that as well for him and watch that. Let's see. 81 times 11 for Stevo. Can he continue the look after getting Vieira? Maybe not. That looks like it's not anything too spectacular. Ah, Mignon. There could be a Danglo into wild card potentially. There isn't. Double walkout's not awful, but I guess... Wait, does that mean the best of aren't in packs anymore? Because Nkunku's not in packs anymore. All right, we have got our next base icon player pick now. What are we saying? Can we get off... Oh, I'm looking for a 700k plus card. It's a lot to ask, but can we get one? Eh. Two Brazilians is quite fun. Roberto Carlos is not awful. 400... 400k? That's actually... Wow. Well, that's actually a lot better than I thought. That's, pre that's pretty good. That is that is way more than the SBC. That is actually good. We'll take that. All right, we have our next base icon player pick now. I don't think so far. We're on a bit of a roll. A couple of Ws, you know? Here we go. Oh, okay. We have Roy Keane, Xavi, Hernandez. I mean, look, you know, Xavi, I don't think's awful. Hernandez, I don't think's awful. Could definitely get into a team, but... You know, that's just not what you want to see, is it? All right, next base icon, player pick. We've got an 81 times 11 right after it as well. That is that is class. I'm not going to lie to you. Desai is a, a very good centre-back this year. That is class. Unfortunately, Matthias is already owned. Del Piero is... Uh, base Del Piero is not bad, actually. But I'd say it's probably the best Del Piero available. Uh, maybe Prime's better. I don't really know. Um, that's an interesting one. That's probably, like, one of the hardest, like, picks, actually. It depends. All right. He wants Marcel Desai, which I respect. I think that's a good choice. Uh, very good centre-back. Very good centre-back this year. No nonsense. Very, very good. And now for the 81 times 11. Can we get a winter wildcard EA? It's a walkout. Does that mean it? It means Mbappe is back in packs at least. So we're looking out for French striker again. Marquinhos 88. Not bad. How about potentially a dangler? 
No. All right, here we go. Come on. Base icon player pick number something. I have no idea. Here we go. Can we get Eusebio, Cruyff, Pele? One of the above would be very nice. Uh, that's like a mid-off, you know, because Petit can play in like three or four different positions. It's a solid card overall, but you probably have better cards. Cannavaro is decent, but I think that there are better centre-back options. Even that buy SPC is better than Cannavaro right now. And Ashley Cole is a decent left-back, but at the same time, like, it's just not that exciting. You know, it's just not an exciting player pick. All right, we've got James base icon player pick. He's recently packed mid Hullet. Let's see who he gets. Oh! <laughs> Mid, uh, mid, base Cantona. Ba the thing is, right? I mean, base Cantona is obviously the pick here. Incredible card. Base Zambrotta is actually sick. Even if you didn't get Cantona, Shevchenko is not terrible. But Zambrotta is also really, really good. That is actually mental. But um, obviously, Cantona, is he our first 700k plus player? I don't know if he's still about that or not. I have no idea. Let's have a quick look. Base Cantona is 600k. Very close, but not quite. But that's a big W. All right, next base icon player pick now for Rex. Come on, EA. Ouch. Yeah, no. Again, mid, really. Makaleli and Lam, not great. I mean, Puyo is not even in the question. I know he can play centre-back, but I have zero, zero desire at all. He wants Lam. Lam's not bad, but not incredible. All right, next base icon player pick. Here we go. What are we saying? Zambrotta is a W. Rooney's not bad just because I love Wayne Rooney. Xavi's okay, but Zambrotta is really good because Zambrotta can play across the back line, I believe, like left back or right back. And to be honest, like stats wise, there isn't many left backs or right backs that are better than this card. And he's four star, five star. That is good. That's a W. All right, we still not had a Cruyff. We still not had a Pele, Eusebio, anyone of that like caliber. We've had a few decent pulls. We're still looking for someone on that caliber. Here we go. Baby Blanc. I mean, that one's satisfying because it's 85, 86, 87. Baby Blanc's not a bad one, in my opinion. Um, I think as a CDM, this card's got potential. But it's not insane, is it? Sadly. In previous FIFAs, he was absolutely favoured as well. But I just don't think he's that hyped up this year. All right, next one. Here we go. Come on. By the way, I was just saying this. Not great. I mean, you got two a United and an ex United player. I say United player, like Skulls only play for United, right? And you got an ex United player in Van Persie. Um, how has Nick Pope not been upgraded? Just random. How has he still not been upgraded? What is going on, EA? Um, unfortunately, not an amazing player pick, sadly. All right, next base cycle player pick. What are we saying? Ha! Huh, great. Thanks, EA. Just what we wanted to see. Patrick Cliver, David Beckham, and Ian Wright. Three of the best base icons a man could ask for. All right. We have got Grand Coppa is next. Lil Bro FC. What are we saying? Will we get our first our first million coin plus card? Will we get one at all today? We'll find out. Ooh, Ronaldinho. I don't know if he's worth a whole lot these days. I remember back in the day, Dinho used to be worth so much all the way up until like his prime came out. I highly doubt he's still worth a huge amount. 600k! 600k! Wow, we absolutely take that. Let's go, man. I thought, I didn't think it'd be that much because he's only got 80 pace, but that's insane. I don't think you'll get anything good. You have World Cup R9 untradeable. Pfft, okay, well, I was right, but Schweini I'd be happy with, X United. Cannavaro meh. Uh, Rivaldo meh. Two-star weak foot lets that Rivaldo card down. If you had four-star weak foot, this card is worth so much more because it's actually a good card, but two-star weak foot. Yeah, it's a very mid player pick. All right, we've got Gassetti's base icon next. Come on. Uh, Baggio's got a cracking mullet, I can't lie. Gra Baggio's got a great mullet, but apart from that, it's just rubbish again. All right, we've got a one of three standard, standard icons. One van three, sorry. Here we go. Come on. Oh, Garincha and Zambrotta. I really hope you haven't already completed Jairzinho or put any follow into Jairzinho. I really hope because Garincha is fantastic. What a W. Is Garincha worth a mil? I don't think he is, right? He's, he's definitely not, is he? Come on. What is Garincha worth? Is he our most expensive pool? 460. Okay, fair enough. Still very good, though. All right. We've got it, man's next. He's got the Foot Whiz badge. Will it bring the luck? Back to back Garinchas. What are the odds? Back to batch good inches. The annoying thing is, he actually already has mid Jezinho completed, which is very frustrating. Could Grinch play any other positions? No, he can't. Still a great card, though. I'm sure you can figure out how to get him into a team. He's a really good card. All right, here we go. Come on, EA. Can we get our first Cruyff or Eusebio? 
but just their center forward basically i'm pretty sure all the most expensive ones are center forwards right pele Cruyff, Eusebio. i think is there anyone more expensive than that i i don't know let's find out who we get anyway come on feels bad feels bad i didn't realize base r9 is 1.4 million not that we've packed him but you know that's also one that could be really good Hey, Nemanja. Whoa, Nemanja. Whoa. He comes from Serbia. He'll... I'm not going to finish that because I like getting ads on my videos. But, you know, Nemanja, let's go. This is base icon player pick 24. I think so far, the still most expensive pull is uh, Ronaldinho, I think. Del Piero is not bad. Paolo is not great. Carlos Piero is awful as well. But Del Piero is okay. That's not terrible. All right. 25. 25th base icon. Carlos Alberto is a, f a massive W. That's quality. I don't know what this card is going for these days, but that is a fantastic centre-back option. Um, what is 87 Carlos Alberto worth? 200k! Really? I am very surprised by that. Because that card is class. All right, we have got our next one now. 800k in the bank. He's got a lot of coins in the bank. Can we get a card worth more than what he's got in the bank? That is one of the best player picks in terms of, like, more than one player being very good. Maldini, class. Can play centre-back, incredible. Cafu, one of the best right-backs on the game. Nedved's rubbish. We don't really care about Nedved. But that's a really good player pick and also a very tough decision. Well, this is a winter wildcard pack. Oh, so we got the we got the icon player pick and a winter wildcard pack. That's a W. All right, here we go. Icon player pick is going to be... Not very good. I think, to be honest, the best there is Zanetti. Yeah, I, I agree with you. You can play right-back or left-back, to be fair. Um, Beckham's okay. I don't mind Beckham just because he's got a really good free kick run up. And he's actually United. He's picking Beckham. Fair enough. I respect that. I respect that. Not a great icon player pick though. Hopefully the guaranteed winter wildcard pack will be better. Come on. Winter wildcard player pack. Be better. Here we go. Be a good nation. It, the lights aren't going up. Oh, oh, 84 rated, man. Are you joking? That is, that is just terrible. That is absolutely awful, man. Awful. All right, we have our next base icon player pick. Can we finally get something insane? Ooh, Georgie B. Again, don't know prices this year. And with with chemistry, I think prices are a lot different to previous years. Is he worth a lot? 400k. <laughs> Big W. Big W. Another winter wildcard guaranteed pack. Here we go. Who is this going to be? You're joking me. 84 and 85. I mean, EA are generous for giving this for free, but not if these are the, the terrible players you get out of them. I'm bad at FIFA is the club name. Brazil and Pele in the background. We love to see it. Hopefully a base Pele in this player pick. Who knows? Here we go. Cracking mullet, though. Cracking mullet. All right, next one. Here we go. Okay, we'll take this IE. Not bad. Very Arsenal-centric uh kind of player pick there with Perez. um but not bad we'll take that all right we have got jake's player pick i really hope jake gets absolutely nothing here i hope he gets someone terrible oh, that's actually quite frustrating isn't it uh because that is a really good player pick i was hoping he'd get nothing i was hoping he'd get someone rubbish unfortunately jake got a, a good player pick so yeah that's not bad at all actually damn all right one of three base icon of the xbox for champions so we're watching him open this on the other screen which is why i'm looking over here here we go. Come on. Let's get Shan something good. Come on, Shan. Something good. Ah, not great at all. Not great at all, sadly. Not ideal. 